Laters. Peace and love. See you later, kids. Yeah, Hackett's Quarry forever. <laughs> hey there, party bear. Status report? We are officially empty nesters. High five up top. Oh boy, you're about to get your phone back, aren't you? Let's go collect our bags and away from this mosquito-infested backwoods dump. Doors locked, bags inside. <sighs> Fuck me. Yep. Well, it's obvious what we have to do here. Find someone with a key? Shape our destiny. And by shape our destiny, I mean shape our way through this crappy lock and grab our bags. Okay, let's do it. We better not get in trouble. I won't tell if you won't tell. Mr. Hackett's gonna find out. So what? I'll just think it was a bear or something. Have you ever seen a bear in these woods? No, but that doesn't mean they're not out there. Fair point. All right, let's do this. On three. One, two, three! Ugh. All about the power of positive thinking. Why do I ever listen to you? Because I'm always right. Are you sure they're gonna think it was a bear? Oh my god, relax. It's not like we killed someone. All right, well, I'm just gonna take another look around, make sure we didn't miss anything. Go nuts. Ready to roll? Let's do it. Finally. Time to let loose and vamoose this caboose. How are you so... Dramatic. Annoying. Confident. It's just acting. It's what the people want. So you're faking it? I mean, in a way, faking it is just being yourself. But louder. You should try it sometime. You never know who you might impress. No. <laughs> it's too late now anyway. For what? You and Nick? You never know unless you put yourself out there. <gasps> oh, oh, wow! Oh. <gasps> nice steering, Tex. Jinkies. Okay, so, hypothetically, if I were to put myself out there, what if he ends up being a dud? Kind of like you and Jacob. He's actually really sweet. Then why'd you quit it? Summer fling. We're going to school like four states away. I, he gets it. Yeah, sure. But that's us. You and Nick could be different. When do you get his handle? Hit him up. Oh, I already have his email. It was in the packet they gave to us on the first day. Email? Are you 93? What's wrong with email? I'm really gonna miss you, Abby. Oh, but the lodge is that way. Go right here. Why? Come on, scenic route? One last victory lap around the camp? Yes. Sure, what's the victory? Two months, no technology. I kind of thought it was nice to be offline. Ugh, I didn't. Plus, my subs need me. You know what? I actually believe you. Abby, was that a compliment? Your charm is infectious, what can I say? <laughs> I'd subscribe. You better. As soon as you get home, sub, share, smash that like button. The holy trinity. Okay, well now I'm really regretting it. Oh no, you love me. <laughs> My favorite spot? The fire pit? The island. Mad secluded, right? Is... Is that smoke? Should we tell someone? Mm, it looks pretty contained. It's probably just Mr. H burning some stuff before, you know, he closes camp for the summer. Yeah. Speaking of which, we should... We should probably, you know, get back. Oh, yeah. Worried Nick's, you know... 
gonna leave it at you. Well, no, they're probably like all waiting for us. Mm hmm. Everyone's waiting for us. Everyone, yeah. Nick, waiting for you. All, everyone, same. Hey, Nick. Hey, where were you guys? <gasps> Wouldn't you like to know? Ignore her, please. Let's go. Just gotta get these bags up on to the... Oh, hey, hey, here. Let me, um, let me get it for you. I can take care of my own bag, thank you. What? Are you sure? Because, I mean, it's really not that big she of a deal. She can take care of her own bag, thank you. We can both take care of our own bag, thank you. Cool. Sorry, Mr. H. Yeah, deliberate some luggage. Shut up. So here we are, stranded in the great American wild with nothing but our wits to guide us. Will humanity prevail or will we grow ravenous and resort to eating the flesh of the deceased like I saw in that one plane crash movie? <laughs> First course, filet au Jacob. Rich and full-bodied, this rare beefcake may leave an irritating taste lingering on the palate. An acquired taste, some would say. Wow. Well. What? Looks like you're trying to thread a needle with a packet of loose sausages. Oh my god, I'm almost done, okay? Jesus Christ. And for the record, your analogies are very hurtful. Okay, I'm almost there. One second. <laughs> ah, there we go! And Viola. Uh, Your hair clip, madam. Yeah, uh, you can keep it. It's not too shabby, huh? Yeah. I like a man who's good with his hands. Yeah, well, they call me Mr. Magic Fingers. <laughs> no, they don't. Okay. So, if I were a beer, where would I be hiding? Beep, 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 beep. What beep, are you doing? Beep. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's my beer dar. Helps me dar for beers. Huh. How am I just noticing how super lame you are? What? But it, it's my beer dar, dude. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go over here. Wow, the kids really wiped this place out. Mr. H loved his accessories. <laughs> Think it's locked. Don't know what I was expecting. Oh, oh, hell yeah! <laughs> oh, jackpot! Hey, uh, check out my giant melons. Oh. See, you just cut a hole in it. Mm hmm. You pour in your vodka. It's party time. You just you pour the vodka right in it. Yeah, it's the most fun you could have with a hole in watermelon. Or, well, second most. Okay, I'm gonna leave you two alone and go look for some more party supplies. <laughs> Harem scarum? Who buys this crap? Friends? Oh, yeah. Q. 
can't pass up an opportunity like this. Okay, have y'all ever seen a grown man crap his pants? Because you're about to. Oh my. <laughs> All right, now where should I hide? Jacob! Emma? Hello? Look, if you're trying to scare me, it's not gonna work. No, they're... they're funny. You think this is supposed to be funny? I mean... yeah. <sighs> well... Do you think it's funny now, little boy? I... oh, because... You want to join 20 of my sexy clown friends in a tiny car that somehow fits us all like it's no big deal? I... I... What? Moment's gone. <sighs> Not forgotten. I wonder where this goes. Locked. <laughs> Jacob! Come check this out. Oh, uh, all righty then. Door, buckle up because you are about to meet your maker. Done. Nice. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Fucking mother love. Good golly, Miss Molly. I wonder he kept this place locked up. I think he'll be pissed when we made a stash. What? No. I mean, he left us stranded here. It's like, um... <clears throat> human rights, or... Whatever. Sure. Yeah. Alright. Now let's see what we are working with. Hold that. The door will latch otherwise. Oh. Hell yeah. <clears throat> In and out. Job done. Boom. I want to look around. Go for it. Jacob, check this out. What? I can't move or else the door will latch. They look like camping supplies. Oh, okay. Um, there's tents back at the fire pit, so just let's let's go. Did a bear do this? Oh, cool. What? What is it? A gun. Oh, cool. And a code. Okay. I'm done. So you're, uh, you're really gonna keep the gun, huh? Yeah, for bears. Okay, uh, well, I am gonna find something to haul this lot back to camp. Hey, very nice. <laughs> what else is in there? Uh, just some fireworks. W oh, fireworks? Yeah, but I don't think we should. No, 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 Emma. Fireworks. Uh, 
You know, you're right. Fireworks. <laughs> yeah, 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 hell yeah. Fireworks. Oh, um, and might I just add, um, fireworks. <laughs> hey, I found these, like, torn up bags back there. They were pretty messed up, and I think they might have had blood on them. Oh, oh, stop. Stop. Stay right there. Uh, <sighs> oh, dude! Peanut butter butter pops. Dude, peanut butter fucking butter pops. What are butter pops? <sighs> no. What? <laughs> I can't believe it. Um, okay. Um, <clears throat> Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. <laughs> pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop. Oh, my God. They're like the greatest snack of all time. What are they? Are they like popcorn? What? No. No, 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 no. They're nothing like popcorn. They're like their own thing. Like their own subgenre of food snack. You know what? I haven't had these since I was a kid. You are in for such a treat. Okay, wait. Is there an expiration date on that bag? Um, no, they're still good. Oh my god, they're like 20 years old, aren't okay. they? Okay, look, they predate expiration dates. Blah. Well, you're gonna love them. Blah. Oh my god. Right. Well, <clears throat> I saw a wheelbarrow out front, so we can load up all our booty in there. Uh, I'm sorry, what? Booty? Oh, it means like, um, like treasure or buds. <laughs> no, before that. Wheelbarrow? Uh, yeah. Um, okay. Uh, it's like, um, it's like a barrel with wheels. You can put stuff in it and just wheel it around. Oh, I see. <sighs> Ladies first. Mm, yep. Which way? My turn. Emma, there. Emma, so you have to kiss. Jacob? Or. You like it better with Nick. Uh. <laughs> well then. Um. Uh, sorry, Nick. This is not uh, even there, obviously. I don't know if that's a good this. idea. I choose Nick. M? Seriously? Guys. Thank you, Nick. He's good. You like kissing my girlfriend, asshole? It was just a game. Hey, I'm nobody's <laughs> girlfriend. The fuck it was? It was just a game. Yeah, the fuck it was, man. Jacob. Grow up. Well, I guess I should probably go after him. You should probably go find Abby. Technique needs work. Hey. Uh, yeah. I guess you're done, huh? Horse. <sighs> Sneaking down here was a little more fun when we thought we could get caught, huh? Yeah, yeah, I guess. Jacob, I thought we agreed that this, us, was just supposed to be some summer fun. Yeah, no, no. I know, I just... 
You just love having an audience, huh? <laughs> Jacob. I mean, you. I can't believe you. Like, you fucking Frenched him. <laughs> you know, in front of everyone. Jesus wept. Frenched? Are we twelve? No, but Nick is. Kind of. <laughs> you know, I love the guy, but I don't think he's actually ever seen a girl naked before. Well, I hate to break it to you, but he just had his tongue down my throat, and he definitely knew what to do with it. <laughs> You, you really love fucking with me, huh? Lighten up, Sarapus, please. This is not how the night was supposed to go. What? You know what? Nothing. No Nothing, never mind. Hey, that's mine. Yeah, well, finders keepers. I'm getting it back tomorrow. <sighs> Fine. You can stand here, sulking. Driving yourself crazy imagining Nick's tongue in my mouth. Ah, oh, come on. Or you can go grab us some towels. What do you need towels for? Well, we agreed. Some are fun, right? Apparently, summer is not quite... Zero. You dick. What the hell? Nope. Get back down here, Jacob. <sighs> okay, well, I guess we could just like drip dry or you, know, you could shake it out doggy style. Wow, you really know how to talk to a girl, don't you? <laughs> Look, you can't just pretend that it didn't happen. <gasps> oh, but I can because you see, oh, help! Help! I'm. I'm drowning, and I, I need a big, strong, not at all insecure man to come save me. <laughs> okay. What's this? A female in need? Fear not, fragile thing. For Hurricane Jake is here. Cannonball! Oh, oh, oh. Cold, cold, cold. Oh, cold. Hurricane Jake. It's not the promised land, but I'm sure this room is planned. Oh, okay. Okay, now you're gonna get it. See? <laughs> hey! Split it! Oh, stop being a uh, Attack! <laughs> Take a picture of me. Uh, uh, yeah, for your like um, little subscribers or whatever, top ten guys who will keep you satisfied at summer camp. Oh, so I get nine more? What? but like not the good kind of scream. I can't hear you. Okay, look, just just hold on. I'm gonna go check it out. What? what seriously?
Let's see what tonight brings. Okay, here's a riddle for you. What's got two thumbs and is suddenly riding solo on a freaky island in the dark? This fool, well, one thumb, one available thumb. Okay. And it was here on this strange, uninhabited island that this brave young soul found herself. Okay, full disclosure, I've suddenly found myself on a, a strange, tiny little island all alone with nothing to do but show you guys around. So, there's a tree house over there. I'm gonna go and see if I can't dish out some of that sweet, sweet panoramic goodness. Because here's the thing, not that I want to go back because I don't, but even if I did, I can't because then I'd look like the super needy one when he was the one who, who stormed off in the first place. God, you know what, sorry, I'm bending. Oh, explore bending. You know what, fuck it. Let's do it. To the treehouse, fellow explorers. <laughs> So this island is like an unexcavated part of the quarry that rewilded itself after it flooded into the lake. Pretty cool, huh? You know, when I was little, I used to think that islands just kind of would float in the middle of the water, kind of like an airbed. But I'm older and wiser now and realize that not everything's always as it seems. Kind of like how you thought you were just having a hot summer fling and then it turns into babysitting a big hairy man child who's all sad because you don't want to go steady with him and write him love letters every freaking day. And while we're talking about it, you don't mind that we're talking about it, right? Why, why is it up to me to justify my feelings when he's the one who got all blah about it, you know? <sighs> oh, look, the metaphor in the narrative by mean a fork in the road. How fitting. Here's the big question. Do I take the high road, literally, and forget about it? Or do I continue on the path I'm on and keep ranting about my stupid dumb life? I guess since this isn't live, the choice is up to me. Ah, oh, what the hell. We're in it now anyway. Well and truly in the thick of it. Because you know what else? I was really excited for the next part of my life, you know? I mean, the summer was great, but what's next? I mean, come on. I know by the time I post this, Hackett's Quarry will just be but a distant memory, and I know it's just one night, and you have to make the most of all your opportunities, and yada, yada, yada. I guess I just don't want to have to settle for what's around me, you know? Abby sees me as this confident person, but really? I'm just desperate to stay afloat in a world where everyone wants to be different. This is actually kind of fun. I feel like this is the first time I've been alone all summer. Kind of like it. I guess that kind of reinforces the whole Jacob thing. I know the plan was for him to come get me, but now that I'm by myself, kind of like it. Sorry, Jacob, if you're watching, nothing personal. It's a me thing. We're cool, right? Yeah, we're cool. I mean, who knows? Maybe in 50 years we'll bump into each other and be flooded with fond memories of that one amazing summer at Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. And that spark that changed our lives forever. Then we'll be like, 70 year old lovers or whatever and have crazy walker sex <laughs> hey it could happen only time will tell jakey boy and as they say time makes fools of us all but we will be the oldest sexiest fools there ever were <laughs> until then i gotta do my thing sorry buddy hmm. thinking about it how could this have been Mr. H when he was back at the lodge? Quoth the raven nevermore.
I guess I gotta do this one handed, huh? That didn't sound great. <laughs> oh, shit. Ah, just thought you should know, I am nailing this ladder climbing. Ah. Oh. All right. <laughs> this is the luxurious Skyway Treehouse, obviously. Constructed in the year 180 fuck by a blindfolded man who used only the finest rotting wood, rusty nails, and donkey spit that money could buy. A real Hackett vintage classic. Honey, I'm home. What's that now? I forgot the children's bedtime. Well now, that's a fine how do you do. Take it all in, folks. That's the summer camp experience right there, and... Oh, look. It seems somebody forgot to clear the place out. I guess one of the kids left their stuff, or maybe one of the guys back there? But... I don't recognize this. Did you hear that? Looks like we have a choice on our hands. Do we snoop through someone else's belongings? Or do we open the spooky trap door and die a horrible, painful death? There are literally no great answers. Bag it is. And you know what? I'm putting some clothes on. This is all you're getting. Okay, so I think there's something up there, and it is not gonna make me jump, I can promise you that much. <sighs> Goodbye, cruel world. The final curtain is calling, and there's no time for an encore.
Doesn't feel safe. Freshener. Oh. Yeah. It's all I could find in the van. So what do we do now? Well, I guess we just make ourselves at home. Live up some cocktails, see what's on the TV. <laughs> Why are you always so positive? Oh, why do you keep asking me that? Uh, I asked you about your confidence, not your whatever is happening right now. Oh, I don't know. I guess I just don't like to see other people sad. Oh, please. What? Is that really what you think of your followers? Just a bunch of sad sacks that need you to cheer them up? Well, come after me. Don't come after my followers. My emanation. You really need to come up with a better name for that. Hell yeah, I do. <laughs> well, fuck this nine, huh? Yeah. Come on. I want to hear you say it. Fuck this night. Fuck it all the way to morning. <laughs> We can't just sit here. Why not? Dylan said it's safe here. Well, yeah, I just... I don't want to be waiting around. But that's literally all we need to do. Just wait until morning, right? Fine. But we need protection. Go see what you can find. It's better than just sitting around. Hope it holds. Oh, fuck. Looks like the main fuse is gone. That's why there's no power? Why would somebody do that? What is it? Silver shells. How'd they get down here? The hunter must have dropped them. This is probably how he got upstairs and attacked Caitlin. Those fucking guys are everywhere. What'd you find? Oh, I'm just checking out this ladder. Is that a tiny little door up there? Uh, yeah. 
We'll open it up. Why? We don't know what's up there. Exactly. Have you not been paying attention, like, at all? Okay, what I mean is, it might be good for us to have an escape route. You know, we don't know what's up there. It, it, the lodge, there, there also could be a, a way for us to defend ourselves. Okay. Guess that makes sense. The office door's locked from the outside. But there must be something we can oh. do. Yeah, but what? Silver shells. If we can time it right, we can give them to her. She passes. If she passes. 